Welcome everybody. This is my review of Pokemon Go. I am reviewing this on the Apple iPhone on iOS. This recently came out free in the App Store. I have been highly anticipating Pokemon Go since it was first announced. This is an augmented reality Pokemon game where it actually pinpoints your location through GPS and you have to actually catch Pokemon out in the wild. With augmented reality, you could catch Pokemon in your backyard, you could catch it in your nearby town, in your supermarket, in a park, wherever you go. It pinpoints you here, as you can see. You could customize your avatar, you could add items to your avatar. You walk around, and it will give you indications on when it finds a Pokemon in your area. Once you find one, it will actually give you a Pokeball that you actually have to spin and flick and hit the Pokemon to catch him. Pokemon can disappear and run away as well. It has a Pokedex of all the Pokemon um, that you have caught so far. Um, I would imagine that they're going to be adding a lot more. If we click the menu here, you can see the Pokedex, you can see the shop, um, items, everything is in there. The Pokemon that you have caught... As you can see, I have three here. We have Pidgey, Slowpoke, and Bulbasaur. When you click on them, it gives you a little bit of information on them. You can spin them. You can check the models out. It's kind of neat. It tells you where you got them, how powerful they are. And it is pretty neat. I have been messing with this since it came out. And I am actually enjoying it a lot. It is free. And um, it's it's pretty neat. If you're a big Nintendo, if you're a big Pokemon fan as myself, this is going to be really cool. Um, you're definitely going to get a kick out of this. Here's the Pokedex. You can find out what number your Pokemon is, which ones you've unlocked. Um, the app does a lot of things. There's actually shops that you can find out in real-world locations. There's different things that you can get. You can earn free things. Um, there is in-app purchases. Um, it tells you the items that you have. Um, there's an actual trap where if you actually set this, you can lure Pokemon in for 30 minutes. I tried it in my backyard and it does work. The Pokeballs that you collect to catch the Pokemon. Your camera and an egg incubator, which has unlimited use. You can find these things out in the wild. You can find them in the game. Uh, there's in-app purchases, like I said. You can buy them. It tells you what nearby Pokemon in your area, and it's pretty neat. If you're actually by a lake or an ocean, you can have water-type Pokemon. If you're out in the forest or the woods hiking, you can find grass-type Pokemon. It's pretty cool. It's pretty neat. I like it. Um, this is my avatar here that I actually customized. You can spin them. You can add items to them. I have a backpack. I have a shirt, pants, shoes I got. Uh, it tells you when you start it. It tells you if you're to a team, you can have a journal here. It says Pidgey was caught, Slowpoke was caught, and there's different things, and it's pretty cool. Um, it keeps track of everything. It's actually a great way to exercise. Nintendo's always been about this, and it really does get you out of the house, and it gets you where you want to take your phone with you and have this app open. Another really cool thing um, about this, this program, about this game, is that there's actually a watch coming out, an actual accessory that you could buy from like GameStop and you wear. It's like 30 something bucks. You put it on and instead of actually having your phone like this when you're walking around, um, you actually don't have to have, you have to have the app on, but you don't have to have your phone on or on the app. Uh, your, your watch will actually buzz the phone and then it'll actually tell you when there's a Pokemon nearby and you aim your accessory. I pre-ordered mine. I'm actually waiting for it to come when it comes out at the end of the month. And I'll actually be reviewing that on my series, uh, Sean Checks It Out. So I'll actually be showing an update video to this game uh, with the Pokemon Watch accessory. So I'm looking forward to that. I actually opened up some pictures here to show you. Um, this is pretty cool. This was out in the front of my front yard here in front of my house. Uh, this is how I found Pidgey. Pretty neat. And... This was in the back of my yard by my pool. We were swimming today, and I, I just happened to see a slowpoke running around in my yard. And that's actually how it comes up with the augmented reality. There's the, the Pokeball. You, you can spin it. You can throw it, flick it, hit the Pokemon, and you catch them. 
and it tells you how many points or whatever is worth and the augmented reality. The augmented reality kicks in automatically once the app uh, finds a Pokemon. I actually could walk around here. I highly doubt I'll find anything here. But if you walk around, your, your phone will start spinning. It will show you an indication that there's Pokemon nearby. And then it will give you the option to go through augmented reality. We can actually find and catch the Pokemon. I like to call it uh, <laughs> Foursquare for video games. You know, like when Foursquare, when you would go to check-ins, you would check into a store or check into a park. This is actually really cool. Gives you um, an incentive to go out and about and explore new areas because you want to find Pokemon that you didn't find. Um, and, you, you know, you're always, always searching for them. There's tons of Pokemon, so there's tons to collect in this game. Like I said, I think they'll be adding a lot more. I think there's like 240 at the moment or so. And you do go up a level. The more Pokemon that you catch, as you can see, I'm level 2, the more higher your level will go. So it's pretty neat. Again, you have all the options here. You have tips, help, and um, it's pretty neat. Actually, let's try, for the for this review purpose, let's try the, um, the incense. See, so with a mysterious... Fragrance that lures wild Pokemon to your location for 30 minutes. Let's try it. Just for this review. Alright. I just put put it there. Now you would walk around. As you can see, it tells you what items are currently in use. It's just 29 minutes, so you get about a half hour uh, until it wears off. And here we go. Look. Oh, it's working. So that was a good idea for this review. So as you can see, you can click on it. Now watch this now. I'm going to put the light on. I shut the light off so you can see the screen on the iPhone better. There we go, right on my, my TV there. Look at that. There's a Pokemon. You have the ball here. See, I missed him, see? Doing this one-handed. <laughs> got him. No, we didn't get him. Oh, I got him. There we go. Let's see if I can focus on here. Oh, he's still there. Got him. Okay. That time we got him. Sometimes it can be a little tricky. Give this a minute or two. Gotcha. Caterpie was cool, so that was a Caterpie. Very, very, very cool. Once that focus is here, it will focus. There we go. You can spin them. And we caught a Caterpie. So there you go. There's another one for my collection. Click the check mark. And now we got 600 XP for that. So we'll probably be leveling up soon. And then if we go into Pokemon, you'll see that uh, he has been added to the collection. So there he is. So that is Pokemon Go. Um, I really like it. I think it's cool. I mean, hey, you can't complain. It's free. Even if you buy the $30 accessory, which you really don't need, it just makes it more convenient. I'm a huge Pokemon fan, and this is for anybody that's a huge Pokemon fan. You definitely, if you own a smartphone, you're definitely going to want to pick up Pokemon Go. You can't go wrong. And uh, it'll work actually off your Google account, or you can sign up for an account. It takes a couple seconds. And um, while I still got this timer going down, I'm going to try to catch some more. So, I will be back on Sean Checks It Out, reviewing this game again once the accessory comes out and I've had time to mess around with it. Take care and thank you for my review. Now go catch them all.